cuisines and the son of the soil honorable prime minister of india shri narendra modi arriving now to welcome the honorable president of the united states of america donald trump and other distinguished guests prime minister narendra modi has given a clarion call of ek bharat shreshth bharat at the howdy modi event in september 2019 prime minister modi had expressed unity in diversity is our heritage it's our speciality and we can see it being showcased it is the proof of our vibrant democracies this is our power our inspiration wherever we go we take the principles of diversity and democracy along with us and the prime minister in his man ki baat address on all india radio yesterday said from kutch to kohima from kashmir to Ka well the foundation of any relationship is the confluence of interest and there are many reasons for both india and america to be natural allies prime minister modi had highlighted in his speech at howdy modi event in september 2019 that be it 911 in america or 2611 in india time has come for a decisive battle against terrorism so security trade is also another important issue america has emerged as india's largest trading partner healthcare wellness ivanka trump when she had met the prime minister in 2017 november in hyderabad she came to attend the global entrepreneurship summit so entrepreneurship education could well be another area that's the us ambassador to india the aim of course is to deepen the friendship between the world's oldest democracy and its largest welcome to india welcome mr and mrs trump the moment that we've all been waiting for with a lot of excitement and anticipation the arrival of president trump and the first lady melania trump to india and the warm welcome the handshake the hearty hug which has now become a symbol of their friendship greetings all around prime minister narendra modi introducing the american president donald trump to the chief minister of gujarat and other dignitaries present this is the first visit to india by president donald trump that was a quick greeting with ivanka trump and jarrod trump the daughter and son-in-law of president trump a tri services guard honoring the arrival of the president and the first lady and the traditional welcome of gujarat the folk dances that are so colorful so warm and so welcoming
The blowing of the conch shells is considered auspicious, pious, and the sound there positively energizes the environment through the vibrations. There is such a festive air here. It is as if all of India has come alive to welcome her guests. And this sort of a greeting, this sort of a reception can only be given in India. And after being greeted here at the Sardar Balabhai Patel International Airport, the American president now slowly, slowly moving out of the airport. That's the golf dance, also known as ribbon dance. Very pleasant weather welcomes the guest. President Trump has come to India on a whirlwind tour of 36 hours and India has decided to make every moment count because there are different kinds of activities that have been planned out for him. After Ahmedabad, he will be visiting Agra where he and his wife will see the Taj, the symbol of love at sunset. And of course, tomorrow there will be a formal reception at Rashtrapati Bhavan. Intricate dance movements and then simplifying it. Joy in the air. visit of the American president to India will go a long way in strengthening our geostrategic ties. There will be many things which will be discussed on various subjects of mutual interest. Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi ji will receive President Donald Trump and the First Lady Melania Trump. A traditional welcome with a Kadi Angavastra or a stole. The significance being explained here to the President and the First Lady. And this is Hride Kunj. This is where Mahatma Gandhi stayed during his 13 odd years here at Sabarmati. His presence is still palpable here. There is a deep sense of peace that permeates the air. His words still vibrate in the stillness here. The president will experience the essence of spiritual India as he enters this hallowed space.
President Donald Trump and Prime Minister Modi. Gala ending the photo of Mahatma Gandhiji there. And uh, we do see a prayer written downstairs. The prayer was written by Mahatma Gandhi in English and it was titled Lord of Humility where he expressed let us be embodiments of self-sacrifice it was while living here that Mohandas Gandhi came to be known as Mahatma Gandhi and this is the symbol of self-reliance the spinning wheel charkha the charkha was gandhiji's great tool for empowerment and dignity of labor president trump and the first lady giving it a try it also has great spiritual significance gandhiji used to say one hour spent in spinning would be equivalent to an hour in self-development for the spinner it's very meditative when you spin the chart